And what's the biggest difference uh, you've noticed from uh, Eugene Asante in terms of, of uh, his leadership and just how he's carrying himself in the huddle? Um, Eugene, first of all, man, very, very great player, very great person, very explosive. He's a he's one of the great um one of the leaders of our team, and I feel like what he brings to our defense is just that speed, that grit, that get to the ball that we need on defense. And um, I feel like he's really maturing as a linebacker. He's getting a better understanding, uh, um, better understanding of the calls. He's getting to us quicker. He knows how to facilitate the defense. He needs he's that field general that we need alongside with um Jeremiah Gimmel. I think he's doing a tremendous job. Can I tell you, uh, sorry, go ahead, Seal. No, I, I, <laughs> I was just going to ask him if anybody has told him he looks like Lawrence Taylor with the, the earrings, but. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Uh, okay, Dina King, go ahead. Hey, Kamen, what are some things that you improved on from last year? You got a lot of playing time, just maybe your strengths and what, what you have learned in one year of playing at college football? Um. Um, first things first, man, it's, it's been a ride, especially the last year, you know, going through all the COVID, um, COVID, Corona um, 19 stuff. But I feel like one of my biggest strengths that I'm going to continue to work on is um, just, just to set the edge as an outside linebacker and also be as versatile as I can, lining up from a four eye all the way to a nine. And um, I feel like as I continue to do that, I feel like I'm going to get better along, alongside some other things like pass rushing and um, developing my skills also inside with the guards and inside shoulders of the tackles. Thank you. Over to Greg Barnes. Uh, Kamen, sir, are you working pretty pretty evenly at both outside linebacker and the end spot? Um, yes, sir. I feel like um, this year, especially in this spring, I'm working more at the rest position than I am in the end position. Like I was last year lined up as a four eye, and if so, go all the way down to a three technique. I'm working more into um, dropping into coverage like linebackers and also setting the edge as a five technique and a nine technique um, and all the other kind of stuff. So I'm working more as an outside linebacker this, um, this coming season. Is that a challenge? I mean, really learning two completely different positions? Um, I'll say that is one of my biggest challenges is learning how to um, drop in coverage. I know um, going like my early on my later years in high school, I didn't really drop into coverage like that. And last year I did that for like little to none. So it's like that's a that's one of my biggest challenges, but I'm ready to face it head on. It's a great challenge, and I also love doing it. So you know, work out in the space like an inside linebacker. Hey, what more can you ask for? Thanks. Okay, we'll uh, we'll close up uh, with Hunter Nelson. Go ahead. Hey, how's it going? So you just talked about defensive versatility a little bit there, and I think one player that really exemplifies that is Jacurius Kindly. You know, making plays in the backfield, also getting some pass breakups in that scrimmage. What are some things that he does that makes him so versatile as a defender? Man, thank you. That's my boy, man. And I feel like um, one thing he brings to the table is his speed and strength and his versatility. Of course, as you point, as you pointed out, I feel like he can come inside as like a Sam linebacker. He's big enough to play that position, but also he just brings that speed off the edge and also drops into coverage just as what um like a safety. So I feel like he brings a lot to the table. And um, I feel like he's just going to continue to get better. His speed, like I said, is his biggest asset. His strength, has, and he's like big body, so he can obviously get in there and blitz like he did in Miami. So he brings a lot to the table, and I really look forward to working with him and getting better with him as the years goes on.